camping air mattress from Lost Horizon. Pretty stoked about this. It looks real nice. Gonna pull it out, check it out, and uh, see how it fits inside the rooftop tent. I think it'll fit well. Oh, good girl. Well, uh, alright. Here it is outside of the box. Um, this is a bag that you also use to inflate it as well. So after your use, you roll it up, you put it back inside of this thing, and then when you use it, you, uh, could, to speed up the inflation process, you can, uh, fill the bag up with air, hook it up to the mattress, and then push the air in, rolling the bag down from the top toward the inlet. All right, here's a look on the inside of the bag. You got uh, read me first information, basic understanding of how the system works, uh, all the instructions, how to roll it back up. Very well thought out. Nice. And here is the mattress. Looks like we got some cool writing on here. We'll see what that says once we get it open. But uh, very nice quality, nice and thick. Cool. All right, we got the Lost Horizon inside the tent. It fits perfect. This tent is uh, 54 inches wide. The Lost Horizon mattress is 52 by 80. So I think this will fit in pretty much any rooftop tent that's out there. We took out the one that came with it and we replaced it with this four and a half inch uh, Lost Horizon air mattress. And I think it's gonna work out really, really well. It's uh, self-inflating right now. And then uh, we'll uh, kind of see how firm that feels to us. And if we feel like we need a little bit more, we can grab the bag right there and use that to air up the mattress. So it's a pretty straightforward little process, nice and easy. So we've been using the Lost Horizon 4.5 inch airsoft mattress for about two weeks now. And we have uh, joined it with the REI uh, Dream Sy Sleep System. Uh, it's just a nice little sheet set up that works really well with this style air mattress. Let's talk about the pros and cons of the Lost Horizon 4.5 inch airsoft self-inflating camping mattress. Start with the pros. Pros are always good. I love this thing so far, to be quite honest. It uh, inflates very, very quickly with our Kika jet fan, and it deflates very quickly with the Kika jet fan as well. Uh, we put it right onto the valve here and push in and suck out the air as needed. Um, it fits perfectly in the space that we have for the uh, for our rooftop tent. The REI Dream Sleep System uh, fits really well with it, so that works out really well. Um, so we are able to have like a normal kind of uh, sleeping system like anyone else would have instead of uh, just a sleeping bag, uh, which is really nice uh, compared to what we were doing, which is a zero degree sleeping bag for a couple of years. Uh, as far as the cons go with this, uh, my only con that I can think of, uh, honestly, is like anything else is if we could make it more rugged, you know, uh, better protection against possible punctures. Uh, this is this is a fabric, um, so it, it is tough, but obviously it is prone to tears. We haven't had any issue with this, but there's always a possibility of that. Um, I can imagine, like, Ella's nail, maybe, if, if I allowed her to jump on this, she could potentially puncture that. So uh, that's something to be aware of. If you have your dog and you're letting them jump on this, I would, I would uh, put a blanket down or some kind of covering to make sure that you don't have any... Uh, accidental punctures in that aspect um, but everything else is really good i'm super happy the build quality is nice 
Uh, we've been using it, like I said, for two weeks now. It's on deflate, and then you just flip it around and inflate, and you can hear that sucker go. I don't want it to inflate right now, so we'll close that back up. But yeah, nice and easy, Lost Horizon, 4.5 inch airsoft self-inflating mattress. Uh, two weeks in, very, very happy with it, and hope uh, we'll see another year or two out of this bad boy. It seems to be very well made and uh, has uh, some long life potential to it. And uh, this is that Kika jet fan that I was talking about that we used to inflate it. Let's see, turn that bad boy on. But this this happens to be the, pretty much the exact size of the valve. And it just... Yeah, so that's what we use to inflate and deflate this bad boy. Works out really well.